Doorbell video from a home at Claremont and Biscayne in Racine shows the moment local and federal officers arrived to serve a search warrant Wednesday morning. We had police in our backyard with chills and snipers. It was like, holy crap, what the heck is going on here? What happens next isn't in view, but police say someone from inside the home shot at officers and hit a federal agent. Officers retreated, they say, without returning gunfire. Here you see two officers take position on the porch. If he comes out the door, I just don't want to hit crossfire coming okay. across. They got this covered pretty good. According to police, officers negotiated several hours with the 36-year-old man who they aren't naming, but say he was wanted on assault and weapons violations. Just a heads up, RPD got a dispatch call from 3720 indicating that there are juveniles in there and she's not opening the door because they're scared of the police. Then just before noon, officers used flashbangs and once inside found the fugitive. They say he took his own life. Neighbors telling us they're still shaken by what happened here Wednesday, but they say this actually isn't the first time police have responded to this home. They did have a standoff with them a couple months ago. Hmm. I think it was kind of over the same thing. It was for a warrant. What happened yesterday? Thursday, two people at the home would not answer our questions. In Racine, Hillary Mintz, WISN 12 News. 12 News has been asking police questions about the investigation for two days now, but they refused our request for an interview. Police say the federal agent who was shot was stable. That agent also has not been named, but was helping with a multi-jurisdictional operation.